Let's eat the fish you just caught. Zauo. Samurai Junjiro Channel. Hi, I'm Akane Maru, born and raised in Japan. Today, I'm gonna introduce Zauo, a restaurant where you can eat the fish you just caught. You can watch many fish swimming around your seat while you enjoy your meal. I'm gonna eat lots of fresh fish that's just been caught, so stay tuned! Now, let's get started! Junjiro seems down since yesterday. He went fishing but couldn't catch any fish, so he's feeling depressed. He was saying, hey, I'm gonna catch horse mackerel and sea bream, so let's eat them for dinner. Why don't we go to this restaurant where you can go fishing and eat the fish you caught? That'll cheer him up. I wonder what kind of fish I'll catch. This is Shinjuku Station, Tokyo. Turn right after you exit the south exit. Walk for about 10 minutes and you'll find the restaurant. The restaurant is located in the Washington Hotel. Found it! We're here! This is the restaurant where you can fish and eat. Zauo. Other than Tokyo, Zauo has 12 locations in Osaka, Fukuoka, and so on. If you're not good at fishing, you can simply enjoy the meal, the fresh seafood meal. Let's enter the restaurant. As you enter the restaurant, you'll see a huge fish preserve and many kinds of fish swimming in it. It's like an aquarium. At the center of the fish preserve, there's a big boat, and that's where you can sit and enjoy your meal. There are so many tables, so no worries if you have a big family. You can see the fish preserve from your seat. Be careful not to fall. Let's fish! First, the shrimps. You catch the shrimps by hooking them. Mmm, will I catch any? Oops, it escaped. One more time. Yay, I got one. It was easier than I thought. It's fun when you actually get one. Let's ask the restaurant to cook the shrimp for us. In Zauo, you can get your fish cooked in any way you like, such as sashimi and fried. There's an English menu and instructions too, so kind of them. Next, I'll go for a horn turban. You scoop the horn turban with the strainer, so even if you're not a good fisherman, like Junjiro, you have nothing to worry about. Oh, the horn turban is alive! I have never seen a living horn turban. Hey, look! This is the shrimp we fished earlier. I chose to have my shrimp in sashimi since they are so fresh. The color of the shrimp's tail is so beautiful, it shows how fresh it is. The shrimp is transparent and beautiful. Put some soy sauce on and let's eat. The sweet shrimp has a plump texture and is so delicious. They fried the head of the shrimp. It's savory and crunchy. And here comes the horn turban. I have the shell on horse turban grilled with soy sauce on. This is the horse turban that was moving just a few minutes ago. I wonder what it tastes like. Let's use the skewer to take it out of the shell. It's a little bit yucky. 
It has a savory flavor of soy sauce and the smell of the ocean. It also has a nice firm texture and is delicious. Next, I'm gonna fish the horse mackerel. As I did with the shrimp, you catch it with a hook. Oh, it escaped again. One more time. Yay, I caught it. Easy peasy. This is fun. I'll have this cooked in a little irregular sashimi. Oh, look. They have these fun games that kids can enjoy. Good for families with little children. The horse mackerel we just caught is here. I kind of feel sorry for the fish, but I'm eating you, horse mackerel. This is minced horse mackerel, and you eat it with green onion and ginger. It has thinly sliced Japanese ginger, which gives you this crispy texture. The fresh horse mackerel is firm textured and plump. It really matches the green onion and ginger. Let's try catching a big sea bream for last. To fish a sea bream, you put bait on the hook, like regular fishing. I hope I can catch one. Oh, I got it! Wow, I caught one! Fresh sea bream. Yuppie! Such a big sea bream. I'll have this sea bream cooked into two kinds of meals. The first one is shimmered sea bream. The fish is simmered with seasonings such as soy sauce and sugar. Smells sweet. It is simmered very well. So the flavor of the seasonings has soaked right in. The fluffy sea bream is so soft that you can easily cut it with your chopsticks. It also has a nice fat and melts in your mouth. The lotus root has the seasoning soaked in, crispy and yummy. The Japanese white radish is simmered very well too. It has a nice flavor soaked in, so delicious. And here's the last meal. I am having the sea bream as sashimi to enjoy the sea bream as it is. The sea bream has just been cleaned, so it's fresh and transparent. Let's eat it with soy sauce and wasabi. You can taste the sweetness of the sea bream, and it's plump just as I like it. It has fat, but not too fatty. So delicious! I had so much fun today! You'll definitely enjoy eating fish even more when they are the ones you caught. Please visit Zaowo and have fun eating and fishing. Well, today I introduced the restaurant where you can fish and eat the fish you just caught, Zaowo. Did you like it? Was there any fish you would like to try? Please comment if there's any food that you were interested in or you would like me to introduce. There are many foods and restaurants that are not in the guidebooks. I will introduce them to you in another video, so stay tuned! Well, that's it for today. See you in another video. Bye bye! Samurai Junjiro channel introduces Japanese culture and more. I will continue to introduce a lot about wonderful Japan, so please look forward to it. If you have any comments, Please write them in the comment section. I would be happy if you could share it with everyone on SNS. Also, please subscribe the channel 
and press the like button.